to my channel. Um, I'm kind of in a rush because uh, I was supposed to like, I have, I'm doing a maintenance vlog if you guys didn't know. Oh my gosh, I'm doing a maintenance vlog if you guys didn't know and I left the camera here uh, like a dummy. Oh my God, wait. I left the camera here like a dummy and then I didn't eat breakfast because I thought I was gonna have enough time to go get breakfast while I was out. No, so I came right back home because I was only like five minutes away from my house. So I was like, you know what? Let me just come back, grab the camera, start the vlog, da da da. So, now I'm on my way out the door. So, yeah guys. But yeah, it's gonna be a maintenance vlog. Oh my gosh, I don't know. Don't knock my bun off now. Bro, I look so tired, but I'm genuinely not tired. It's just, I don't know what it is, but like my makeup, it always looks like that. Like, it always makes me look freaking tired when I'm not. I'm gonna put you guys right here because I think you guys will stay. And I'm gonna put on my GPS and stuff. Oh my God, y'all, I'm not even gonna play with this thing. Okay, cool. My apartment's at 11. It says I'm gonna get there at 10.59. Oh, I have to start the car, though. And then... I'm a mess, y'all. I'm, I'm a mess. And it's like, I'm always like this. Even for school and stuff, I'm always behind. Like, it's stupid. But I have good time management. Like, I woke up, like, two hours early and stuff. Like, I was ready for this appointment because it's a hair appointment. Like, who's never... Like, who's not going to be ready for this hair appointment? Or for their hair appointment? Like, definitely not me. Because lately... Hairstylists haven't been like taking, you know, crap from people. You know how they be, like with these strict rules. But unfortunately, um, I didn't drop my wig or, oh my God, I wasn't supposed to tell you guys what I was getting. But I would, <laughs> I didn't drop off the hair because, okay, let me tell you guys. So I got out of school on Friday at like 11 something and then after that i had went out to eat and the drop off time is from like 11 a.m to freaking from 11 a.m to freaking what 6 p.m and so me i didn't tell anybody that i needed to drop my hair off because i was like oh it's fine like i could just drop it off saturday or sunday or Monday but even though Monday was Memorial Day like I should have known like I should have just dropped it off when I could so basically what happened was I go and freaking text the lady and tell her I wasn't able to make it Friday because Friday went by and I just left it alone and then she never responded and I was like this girl and I texted her about three four five six times and I know she got my message because she has an iPhone, I have an iPhone, and it showed up blue. So I'm just like, what is your problem? Like, I hate when people do that. Like, don't con like don't conduct business like that. Because then it's like, you rub me the wrong way, and now I'm going to have an attitude when I see you. Because it's like, why would you do that? Don't be fake. But yeah. Other than that, I don't know. I was going to book... I was going to book a different appointment. But, like, with a different person. But I was just like, mm, cause I already paid my deposit for this place and I wasn't interested in like rebooking. And I actually did, but then the lady, she canceled my appointment cause I didn't pay a deposit. I was like, hold on now because I'm not gonna be paying 20, 20, $40 for these damn deposits. Like, let's be for real. But yeah, the police is right there. I gotta slow my butt down. But um, yeah, I don't know. But I'm gonna just, I'm gonna take this with a grain of salt because I have all my money. I have everything. I got the wig So it's all in a matter of me just like sitting there and how long I'm gonna be there because I also have a lash appointment After this that I booked for 4 p.m. Because I didn't know how long my hair was gonna take and I also have booked my nail appointment today But I changed it to tomorrow So yeah, this is gonna be a little maintenance vlog. I don't know what other like stuff I should post so if y'all I don't know but like I said just comment down below if you guys want to see certain stuff I was thinking about doing like a like a girl talk because I feel like a lot of girls like need that or like just a girl talk so that everybody can see like my point of view from certain stuff let me know what you guys think about it down below 
but uh yeah so i'm currently 18 minutes away i have my breakfast and my energy drink and i'm just gonna listen to some honcho because um his 22 album is real good i will listen to that album since it came out baby it's good if y'all listen to it y'all need to listen to true to my religion abide by the band top floor what else what else um no heart in them damn the whole album is just good just listen to the whole thing bro just listen to the whole thing but yeah i'm gonna see y'all later i don't want my battery to die so y'all just bear with me but yeah okay hey guys so the hair is done and i didn't vlog there because girl let me tell y'all the story so basically i get there she was an hour late an hour late she walks in doesn't even acknowledge that i'm sitting there because remind you i'm waiting like in the waiting room where she knows people are waiting for her because that's where her clients wait for her and she walks right past me acts like she doesn't see me doesn't say sorry doesn't say hello nothing so i'm like okay cool okay cool and then i'm waiting for her to call me back that takes like another 30 minutes i was like okay okay but i'm chilling though because i'm like you know what it's all right like it's okay then I get in there, she starts going on like this whole rant about how like I texted her and that she doesn't respond on that phone, but she texted me off the phone before, so I don't know why she would text me off that number if she doesn't respond to messages on there. Anyway, she does that, and then she proceeds to say, oh, it's not your fault though, but like still, I don't respond. The And I said, okay, so then where do I text you from then? And she says, it's in my bio. Okay. All right, like, okay, I'm just taking all these hits because I'm just like, oh, it's okay, I got something for her. And then, while she's doing my hair, it's, no, it's not really a problem. We start talking, little conversation. Oh. And as I'm actually as doing my hair, she starts talking, little conversation, you know, we're cooling. Then she gets on, she walks out, she gets on the phone, and she's cussing up a storm, like, like she has no sense. And I was like, okay. She's on the phone the whole appointment. And then I'm on my phone because obviously I'm bored. So I'm on my phone, like, on social media, talking to my friends, like I usually do. And she starts getting to the part where she's laying my hair down. Hold on, y'all. Hello? All right. See ya. Bye. Living good, living better. Like, what are you, like, we've discussed this already. Let me just retell the story. So, yeah. So, I get to the last place. I mean, not the last place. Oh, my gosh, y'all. I'm starting to lose my train of freaking thought. I'm trying to find some good lighting for us. Okay, this is fine. Let's do this. Okay. So, yeah. I didn't vlog when I was there because the lady literally was so rude. And I was just like, oh, my gosh. She was going on a whole rant like okay first of all she walks in she sees me sitting there she knows i'm waiting for her she just passes me straight and i'm just like do you not see me sitting right here waiting for you passes me straight doesn't say anything remind you she was an hour late one hour late i was sitting there for one hour i had told the lady that was working because it's like a salon but a whole bunch of people work in the salon and i told her to text her because there's no reason why i should be here longer than expected like i had to rush out of my house to come here just for you to be an hour late like that's terrible and so yeah, it's just inconsiderate of people's time and just being inconsiderate, period. Like, be punctual. This is your job. And then, yeah, so then I'm waiting for her to call me back because obviously I'm not just going to walk right into the room as soon as she comes there because she needs to set up the place. So I'm waiting for her to call me back and she's like, oh, you can come, you can come back. Ugh, whatever she said, something stupid. And she was like, you can come back here, darling. And then she, I get in there and she's like going on this whole rant about how like I was texting her personal number and how she never texts her um, clients off of personal numbers. This is done the third. And I'm just like, okay, then why did you text me off that number in the first place? Like, don't do that. And then she's like, yeah, but it's not your fault because I texted you off there. This is done the third. But still, if there was another number I needed to text let me know so I'm not continuously blowing up your phone. Cause I was blowing up her phone because I was trying to figure out like, cause I didn't drop my wig off in time because I did not have any time to do it last week. Don't mind the people working on the roof, like please. But um, yeah, and then I'm over here like stressing out. I'm just like, okay, so how am I gonna get this wig to her before this is that third? It turns out you can just 
give her the wig the same day. You just gotta pay $45 extra, which I'm fine with. So, yeah. But it's like I still wanted to drop it off in advance because that's what her policy is. Because to respect her, you know, job. But yeah, I get there. She's like, yeah, you can just do same day drop off. Like, that stuff is already mentioned. Like, that's why I was just, um, that's why, that's another reason why I didn't respond. And I was just like, okay, but it's still unnecessary for you to tell me why you didn't respond because I'm here now. So what's the problem? Like, you know what I mean? It was just so unnecessary. Like, I don't know if I'm tripping, but I don't think I am. And then she's doing my hair. We're talking, cool, cool, cool. She's trying to like redeem herself, like redemption. And so I'm just like, all right. And then she gets on the phone cussing up a storm i'm just like is this who we are is this who we are like saying the b word mm. like obviously everybody cusses every once in a while i get that but at your job or you have somebody in your chair that you're talking to and just you get on the phone mid-sentence that's rude and then she starts to get to like this point where it's like she don't want nobody to ask for nothing like she just gave bully vibes and i was just like what are you doing and it's right after she found out my age too she said how old are you and i said i'm 16. she was like oh okay and then that's when she felt like it was her cue to be bullying me and i was like okay cool because me one thing about me i'm laid back i will not say nothing but i will show that on the price you're not getting a tip from me you're not getting nothing from me nothing and so anyway um what happened after that then oh my gosh she was doing my hair like she was laying it down and stuff like you see how it's laid it's it's definitely laid but it's like you know what i mean like it's cute i'm not even lying it's so cute like it's something different for me but it's like she was laying it down and she was like i need you to get off your phone turn to the side like how i had it this is down the third and i was like oh so after that, I just I just stayed off my phone because I'm just like, I don't need her to tell me nothing else because if she tells me something else, I'm going to go off. And I didn't want to go off on her because I know she's the type that's like ghetto and ratchet. So if I was to do that, she probably would have tried to fight me, which I do not have the time for. Like, I don't have time to be fighting. Just do my hair so I can go, bro. And so, yeah. And then after that, I was just turned off the whole time. Like, I was just like, girl, finish it up. Because I was going to vlog in there, but I was like, you know what? I'm not even going to ask her for that much. I'm not even gonna ask her for that much. Let me just, let me just end it right there. So then, like the total is this is then the third. It, 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 it. Girl, I had a stack of money, far more, like, you know, a couple hundred dollars. And obviously, she told me a price. She said 155. I misheard her. I thought I heard 145. So I counted out 145, checked in everything. I gave it to her. She said this is 145. I said 155. And she says, actually, pull out your calculator just to see if if I'm, um, if, like, my calculations are right. You pull out your calculator. What you telling me to pull out my calculator for? And so, yeah, that was it for me. And I counted it, gave it to her, just like that. And she was just like, she was like, thank you, darling. Do you like your hair? Yeah, I like my hair. But now I'm going to run the out of here because what are you doing like it was just so much unnecessary attitude and it didn't ruin my day because thank god i know how to deal with people because if i didn't <laughs> if i didn't if i was if it was old me i probably wouldn't have said nothing either because i'd be quiet like i'd be so quiet but you know what she really pushed it but you know what it showed with the price i did not give her a tip she don't deserve it she don't deserve no she don't deserve no damn tip. Come on now. But it is currently 3.55. And my last appointment is at 4.30. So y'all gonna come with me to take off my makeup because I wore makeup there because I like to feel pretty when I get out of the chair. Like I would have went bare face, but it's like I wanted to be on camera number one. And number two, I like to look pretty as soon as I get up out of the chair. I feel like I should have probably booked my last appointment before my hair appointment so we could have just been like the whole shebang. But you know what? I did it how I did it because that's what I did. But yeah. But y'all know I love my bathroom. Like I'm just such a bathroom girly. I love being in my bathroom. Like I be eating in my bathroom. I be drink I be drinking juice in my bathroom. Like y'all real ones know. If y'all know me from middle school, y'all know it already. But yeah, I'm gonna just take off this makeup. So I'm gonna time lapse it and yeah, if I look stupid, y'all already know. Time lapse just be going real, real quick. So yeah. You're telling me you 
falling out of love with me Hope you can find someone to love you better than I did Taking our memories on love and treating it like nothing Taking our memories on love and treating it like gossip It's my love for my grandmother made me gentle when I kept it the bare face eats so bad. Y'all, I have no idea what that is, bruh. It's like certain perfume be breaking me out, like on my neck. Or even if I put perfume on like anywhere around my neck area, it's like it breaks me out. I have no idea what it is. My skin is so sensitive. But it's going, it's going away. But, you know, everybody got something they got to deal with. And mine just so happens to be sensitive skin. My skin is so sensitive. But... Yeah, now I'm going to go in with this. Um, y'all know my cellar water, my cellular, whatever. I think it's my cellar water. I never really say it because I just know what it is, but y'all, you know, y'all get it. <sighs> but yeah, oh my god. And then the lady who was doing my hair, she was like, "No offense if you're Hispanic or anything, but like, there's this just there's this particular person that I'm talking about." Like while she's on the phone, I'm like, "Girl." Just don't even say it. Like, if you gotta say all that, but anyway. Hold on, y'all. Let's, let's go see if they was knocking on my door. Y'all, this look like a darn. Why do I look great? Come on now, camera. And why is my camera dying? Like, oh my gosh, the battery's dying, so I'm gonna charge it. Okay, I had to make sure they wasn't knocking on my door. But my camera's about to die. But I'm just about to wash my face and put sunscreen on. And then I'm gonna make me some food. And then I'm gonna head to the place. But until then, I'm just gonna put my battery on the charger. So yeah. Peace out, y'all. my color like yeah. in my eyes because they're like brown yeah oh my god look i'm looking like somebody's auntie can i see the video yeah i'm gonna take another one okay i take a lot because yeah you never have too many videos yeah i take a lot and then i do like a collage Pretty. We already pretty. You. Pretty. Thank you. But yeah, y'all, I just got my lashes done. They look so bomb. If you guys are looking for a lash stick in West Palm, look, it's Young Look Lashes, right? Yeah. Young Look Lashes. I'm gonna put it right here. But yeah, book her. She has great customer service and her prices are reasonable and she does lashes really good duh but yeah i don't have no makeup on right now so i kind of look bare but y'all get it and tomorrow i get my nails done so y'all ready all right thank you hey y'all so i made it back home Safely, of course. Let me put you guys down because I'm like. <clears throat> okay. But yeah, I made it back home safely. Um, this hair is 30 inches, y'all. This is very long. But um, yeah, I made it back home safely. It is currently raining, if you guys can see from the sunroof. Let me actually close that. I have to turn the car on. I'm not doing that. But um, yeah, I made it back home safely. And now I'm finna go inside, handle my business, and then I will see you guys most likely either tonight, like later on, or I will see you guys tomorrow at my nail appointment. So yeah, the girl who did my lashes, chef's kiss, she did a great job, and she's so sweet, and she's so sweet, but hold on y'all, my mom's phone. Hello, I'm here. You want to say hi to the vlog? 
What's up? <laughs> Wait, say it again. What's up? That's my mom, y'all. But yeah, I'll call you back. Oh. Okay. All right, bye. Bye bye. Okay. But yeah, I just talked to my mom. Let me just pause this. Um, I was just talking to my mom. Y'all heard everything, but I'm gonna edit some parts out because it's just like annoying stuff. But yeah, I'm waiting to go to Target. But it's like it's raining, but not really raining for real. And I spilled mac and cheese in this car, but I just cleaned it out because, girl. Mm -hmm. But my hair is so good. Like I wish my real hair would like be this long, cause I wouldn't even have to wear a wig, cause this is what my real hair looks like. But you know, it's life. Wigs aren't so bad after all. But yeah, like I said, that lady. It turns out she's rude to everybody. So it wasn't just it wasn't just me. I wasn't tripping. It, everybody has went through that with her, or at least most people. And I'm like, can we leave a bad review on like Yelp or something? Like, is there something that we can do so that she can either stop doing hair or stop doing it? But it's like she's stuck in her ways. Like she's not willing to change. If that makes sense. Like you know, people who just so stuck in how they act because they don't like to be told nothing. Like I hate people like that. But, you know, what can I do? It's her business, so I'm just go to a different business. But it's like she do hair too good for me to be going to different businesses, but it's like she just too disrespectful for me. Like, I'm not willing to deal with that. And it's like, the next time she try me on some dumb BS, I'm gonna talk to her. But it's like, she not gonna put her hands on me if I talk to her. I don't know why, but like, I hate girls who act like, or who know they can beat you up so they treat you away. Mm, that right there, I hate that. Cause it's like me, obviously I'm not gonna get you up. I'm too classy for that, I'm too good for that. Like, I'm too good for a lot of stuff and that fighting stuff, I'm way too good for. I don't even fight girls at my school. Like, why would I fight a hairdresser? Like, it's not even worth it. Y'all peep my gold. I got a gold, if y'all can see it. I don't know if y'all can see it, but it's like a gold Pandora thing. I wear all gold, but it's like gold with diamonds in it. This is just my signature jewelry. Like, I wear it every day, everywhere. Like, I even wear it to sleep sometimes. Not all the time, because I remember I had lost this ring when I went to sleep. And I could not find it. It turns out it was in my freaking bra drawer. Like, where I keep all my bras and stuff. It was in that drawer. And I was like, what in the world? I was doing laundry one day. And I seen it. And I was like, oh my god. I would have never found it. God is good. Because, Lord knows how long it would have taken me to find that thing because I thought it was under my bed I had my dad take stuff under my like from under my bed and stuff <sighs> y'all I just talk too much bro I just like to talk if y'all didn't know but I feel like I'm so quiet on social media if you would be like dang did this girl not talk and I'm quiet at school too I don't talk to nobody at school but um the people that get it get it like not everybody like not everybody needs to be talked to like i don't like talking to people like that i'm gonna be honest but it's like there's certain people that i love talking to so i'm gonna make ways to talk to you but a lot of people most of the time especially the people at my school no i'm not gonna say i don't mess with y'all but like i don't i don't <laughs> i don't all my friends are like outside of school obviously everybody knows that but um yeah i don't really know what to talk to y'all about because i'm just loafing right now like i'm not doing anything i'm not going nowhere so i'm just trying to see do i get out the car or do i stay inside i mean do i get do i get out the car and go in the house or do i just go to target like y'all know i love me some target though i love me some target but i might go in there and give me a starbucks just because like you know when you get your hair done and your and your lashes done you just want to be seen like i just want to be seen and called pretty like that's that's what i want like online is be cool like when people call you pretty and stuff but it's like in person that stuff is so different like especially when it comes from a girl like because you know girls don't keep be hating on a phone though. boys they call anything pretty so i can't really trust y'all but go to the gas station man it's wraps it's wraps <laughs> but i'm gonna see you guys later oh my god i look so good like this is different but yeah Okay, y'all, so I don't, I don't have on any, oh, damn, I don't have on any makeup, so it's like my lace is not really blending right now, but I'm not putting on makeup just to go to this nail appointment. I'm just going to be, like, completely honest, but yeah, I'm going to go to this nail appointment. 
it's like what i'm su I was supposed to have been gone because oh, my mom told me to leave at 9 20 but it is 9 24 and i still haven't made breakfast and i don't have my shoes on so y'all know what that means might be late but it's for a good cause i gotta bring my airpods because <sighs> y'all know how that goes gotta bring my cash y'all know how that go like gotta pay everything in cash i don't have my tripod on it right now or on the camera right now so bear with me hold on but yeah y'all i'm excited to start this youtube stuff because it's summer i don't have nothing else better to do besides start youtube because i feel like it's just been a forever dream of mine like you know when you just have like a certain goal you want to reach in life and being a youtuber is one of mine but um i feel like that's cliche though everybody says they want to be a youtuber but nobody ever freaking does it i think y'all i want to wear these chanclas chanclas is sandals in spanish y'all if y'all didn't know i am spanish but mm, should i wear these with the i don't know i don't want to wear these these look so like stupid i want to low-key wear my um tory birch and my Tory Burches are... Oh, wait, 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 wait. Never mind. I don't want to wear my Tory Burch. I want to wear my gold sandals. I got these for my Sweet 16. Oh, my gosh. And, y'all, the people for the roof are still here. Like, they came back. But I'm going to wear these gold chunkles with my outfit. And, yeah, I'm wearing, like, all white. Because I feel like I look the best in white. And, like, all my... Like I told you guys yesterday, all my jewelry is, like, gold. So, it makes sense for me to be wearing gold. With everything but yeah i'm gonna bring my telfeezy i need another one i just don't like i'm never on the lookout for any purses or anything because i don't care like what's the word that's not really my main focus right now let me make sure i have everything 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 yeah i don't know purses and stuff are never really my main focus like i'm always on other stuff if that makes sense like i'm never trying to look for stuff to buy i'm trying to like set you guys up but you guys might fall, but that's whatever. But I'm going to make some egg bites because these are just that good. I get these from Costco. They're called spinach and bell pepper egg bites. They're so good. like, And they're so healthy for you. And they have like a lot of protein in there for you. If you guys are into that. But I know I'm into protein because I do work out. So like any protein is like good protein for me. But, yeah, y'all, so, other than that, I'm just gonna, like, I'm gonna take you guys with me, obviously. I don't know what is up with the focus. Like, be for real. But, this is the hair dry. I don't know why my skin is, like, looking a different skin tone. It's, like, <sighs> it makes me a little bit upset. But I think I'm just gonna take, like, this for breakfast, like I did yesterday, because I need the energy, bruh. I do. I need it. But yeah i'm gonna talk to you guys when i'm at the nail place because i'm kind of like in a rush okay y'all so i am back my skin is so oily right now but i got my nails done they're just french tip i could have recorded in there because my nail lady is just she's just the best i love her and my toes look the same i'll show you guys my toes probably when i like but um I'm all done up and stuff, but I'll talk to you guys when I get home because I don't want to end the vlog just yet. Like, I want to... But, yeah, I'm going to talk to you guys when I get home. And, yeah. Hey, y'all, so I'm back home. I think it was the lighting that would make my lace look bad, but I feel like my lace don't look bad. Like, it look good. I just need to put on makeup. But I don't need to put on Nan, actually. I'm just cute how I am. But, you know, makeup just enhances your look. So, y'all know. But, yeah, I'm finally home. It's been like an hour and some change. And I was at the gas station, bro. I was just making so many videos. I was taking so much pictures because I want you guys to understand something. I've been in hiding for so long. And I personally feel like school does that to me. Like, when I go to school, I don't get dressed. I don't do my hair. Well, that's a lie. I always do my hair, but it's my natural hair. And if you guys know me personally, like y'all know, I have curly hair. Kind of like this, but it's not like as long. And I wear it out most of the time or like in a bun. 
but I'm just over it. Like, being a natural hair girl is cute, but I need to grow my hair first, which is why I'm trying wigs, because I personally feel like underneath the wig, my hair can grow a lot. You feel me? But, I don't know. At this rate, at this rate, I think I'm going to keep getting wigs, because, girl, look at this. Look at this. 30 inches down to my ass, okay. But, yeah, so, I'm just walking around, because, y'all, I like to walk around. I like to walk around but i might go to the gym later it really depends on how i'm feeling but yeah i'm gonna see what i can make to eat though because i'm home alone duh like i don't know i'm home alone so you know i gotta be independent even though i'm already really independent but y'all independent to an extent to an extent but yeah and if y'all don't follow me on Instagram already, follow my Instagram. I'm going to put it down below too, and I'm going to put it on the screen. But I'm pretty sure everybody that's watching this is on Instagram. I'm going to be honest. But I'm going to see if I can edit this, or I'm going to see I'm gonna see if I can find an editor. Because I don't like, I'm going to be honest, I don't like editing. That's like the only turn off with YouTube. Like, I don't like editing nothing. But, you know, I'll be fine. I'll be okay. But, um... Yeah, man. I don't know what I'm gonna make. Oh, let's see what I can make though. I've been listening to some Wiz Haven because I forgot about him low key. Like, I had to get reminded about TikTok because I used to listen to Wiz Haven like back, back last year, like in December or something. And then I just stopped because, you know, like my type of music is Drake. Like, I love Drake. Like, I know most of his music by heart. And I really, really, really like Future. So, like, them two is, like, the main two that I listen to, like, all the time. Like, on a daily basis. Especially Drake. But, like, I'm tired of, like, of the slow music. Like, they make fast-paced music, but it's nothing new. It's old stuff. So, I'm just, I don't know. But, yeah, guys. This is the end of the vlog. If you guys like this vlog. <laughs> I'm sorry. I can't take myself serious at all. But, yeah. If you guys like this vlog. Go ahead and subscribe. Y'all already know. Y'all already know the deal. Comment what y'all want to see me do next down below. Because I low-key like this, this little vlog. It was like cute and simple and sweet. But y'all know. I'm trying to be more consistent. So just comment some stuff y'all want to see. Or go on my Instagram and type me something. Because, you know, I don't respond to DMs because... It's nothing personal. I just don't like my main account. Like, I be on my Finsta, but my Finsta is something that's, like, very sacred. Like, I don't give my Finsta to everybody, so I will not be linking that nowhere. But, yeah, so, <sighs> this is going to be the end of the vlog. And I hope you guys enjoyed. I hope you guys watched the whole thing. Even if you didn't, um, you're here watching this. So, keep it cool. Keep it kosher. But, yeah this vlog was cool like i got my nails done you see i got my hair done and my lashes done so we on it popping and oh i never showed y'all my toes hold on to match my oh my gosh i have to zoom back out y'all and to match my fingernails y'all see it y'all see it other than that y'all that's just gonna be the end of this vlog i love you guys um comment down below what you guys want to see next or you know dm me on instagram but like i said i might be doing like a girls talk video i really don't know yet but most likely i am like a monk bang girl talk because i feel like it'll be interesting to like get somebody's or to get my point of view on certain things that people have questions about so yeah let me know some but yeah i'll see you guys another random day and